What is going on guys? My name is PokerRev and welcome to the Poke Cave. Guys, today I am so excited because right next to me I have a factory sealed case of Pokemon cards with some packs in there being almost a decade old. So check it out. This is a Legends of Justice factory sealed case inside of here are 12 collection boxes So hopefully you guys can see that but guys these collection boxes have black and white era Pokemon cards I'm gonna open this up right now We're gonna open up one of the collection boxes in here as well And we're gonna go through guys There's plasma storm as one of the sets in here which you could potentially pull out a secret rare Charizard or Blastoise So we're going into this right now. I'm gonna open this up and show you guys this tape is like so old It's falling off but check it out. Oh, all right. I got to show you guys this. Boom. If you guys could see that, there are 12 collection boxes in here. In this case, so we're going to pull one out. Let's take this one. Oh, this is insane. So this is the Legends of Justice collection box. Um, and check it out. There is a black and white base set pack right there. A black and white boundaries cross and a black and white plasma storm that's the one where you get the secret rare charizard and blastoise i know those cards are very expensive in a psa 10 then you got the promo cards up there as well so i'm really excited to jump into one of these and see if we can get some crazy pulls but before we do that let's get the hands warmed up real quick with boom a hidden fates charizard tin guys i just have been on the hunt again for another charizard I got my Charizard a while ago, and now it's like, it's it's calling me back to try to get another one. So, let's go in with one tin. We're going to go with four packs out of here, and we're going to see if we could do it again. So, it looks like we got all four artworks. Let's start off with the Mew. Now, I don't know. Maybe we'll get super lucky and get one out of here, but we'll see. And then after this, we're going to jump into that, and I'm really excited. I've never opened up a Plasma Storm um, or boundaries crossed either. So that is going to be really exciting. So here we go. Let's get warmed up and see. Maybe we can even get something big along the way here. We're going to start off. Farfetch, Brock's Grit, Jigglypuff, Ekans, Geodude, Cubone, Eevee, Clefairy Reverse, Mr. Mime. All right. So one pack down, three to go. This, that, that collection box. I'm just, it's just staring back at me like I'm so ready to open it. I was so excited when I got those in and now I'm ready to share it with you guys. I want you guys to experience opening up one of those because I've never seen one of these Legends of Justice boxes get opened up before. Ekans, Psyduck, Staryu, we got a Magneton Shiny and a Vaporeon Hollow, so two hits back to back in that pack. I'll take that. All right, let's see what the Charizard is going to do for us. I've been thinking about possibly starting off some videos more often with a Hidden Fates tin opening just to kind of get this out of my system. Sometimes it just comes in waves. I'll Sometimes I'll just really want to open up Hidden Fates. Clefairy, Staryu, a Coughing Reverse, and a Golem. All right, we got one more pack left. The Legendary Birds. Will this bring us the luck on this final pack? And then we jump into the big boy the legends of justice collection box i don't know what the exact year is on that box but i think it might be something like 2013 i'm gonna say we could check out the back once we jump into that pikachu this is the final pack Let's see what we get jigglypuff eevee pokemon center lady reverse and a gyarados gx nice card to finish on and then we jump into this here we go this it is sick. The Legends of Justice. Let's check out the back. The three legendary Pokemon of Justice are finally united in the outstanding Pokemon TCG Legends of Justice box. The great collection includes three Pokemon TCG booster packs, three awesome special foil Pokemon cards, um, and the recently discovered legendary Pokemon ready to gallop into battle. Three Pokemon TCG packs are inside of here, and that's what we really want to see. All right. So we're going to go into this, and maybe, just maybe, we could get that Secret Rare Charizard out of one of these packs. I'm really happy that this pack, in particular on the left there, is the Lugia. That's got to be my favorite Plasma Storm pack artwork. Alright. 
So here we go. Boom. Did it say the date on there too? I forget. Yeah, it's probably the bottom. 2013, I was right. So 2013 Nintendo. So there it is. Let's get that out of the way. Let's grab out the good stuff in here. Here's one of the promo cards. I kind of want to pull this out. Eh. It's hard to pull these out, but I'll show you that. I'll show you that one. The other two might be a little bit easier to get out. I don't want to damage it, so I'll put that to the side. So we got Plasma Storm Lugia. This is from 2013. This is the set where you could potentially pull out the Secret Rare Charizard Blast. So there's even a Lugia Full Art EX in there. There's a ton of really awesome stuff. Uh, this is the black and white base. So this is another good set. The Reshiram and Zekrom. Um, and there's a Secret Rare Pikachu that you could potentially get out of there as well. And then the Boundaries Cross from the year 2012, I believe it is. Lots of really awesome EX cards. I think there's a Full Art Celebi in that set, I believe. Then the Verizion is one of the promo cards here. This is a Black Star promo, BW70 Verizion. Looking really nice. And then we, of course, have Cobalion, if I could get it out of there without damaging it. That's always the problem with these is you got to be really careful. That actually looks pretty good, actually, so... Put that to the side. Cobalion. It looks like in the woods, just kind of galloping or whatever. But an awesome card. The quality is actually pretty decent on these. So we're going to see. All right. I'm really excited. I say we started off with the black and white base. Then we move to the boundaries crossed. And then finish it off with the plasma storm. Uh, we're doing it in order of release as well. So 2011, 2012, and 2013. So let's get it, guys. See what we can get out of here. So black and white base. Doesn't have a ton of huge hits. There's only about three, honestly. Um, but yeah, the Reshiram, the Zekrom, and the Secret Rare Pikachu are basically the big hits. And of course, I don't know the pack trick. I'm going to do... Um, let me do two from the back just to be safe. I feel like it's probably more, but I'll just get two to the front. Hopefully, I didn't mess anything up here. All right, so let's start it off. We got a Dewat. All right, that, this this dude always freaks me out. I've opened black and white base up before. I actually opened up a whole box if you guys want to check that out. I'll leave a link in the description. Joltik, we got a Tepig. So we got one shot for each of these sets. Hopefully we can make it happen here. Energy Search. We got a Fire Energy. I like the design on these as well. It's kind of like a checkered board in the background there. Really nice. Reverse Stoutland. Okay, so it looks like there is one more. I'll just go for it. Let's go for it. All right. Fingers crossed. We got one shot to get a big hit. Oh, Darmanitan is the non-hollow. And then a full heal non-hollow. So we just got a reverse out of that black and white base set pack. But that's all right. We're going to every... We keep moving forward here. We keep getting better hits that you can potentially get out of here. So boundaries crossed is the next setup. Released in the year 2012. Legend revealed powers joined boundaries crossed. All right, I like that. So the pack is like white, pretty cool. It looks like it's ice all over it. We can jump into this. There's some good potential in here as well. Ooh, code card, okay. Unlocks, this might be one of the first code cards um, that you get. Unlocks one online booster pack. I like the design on here. I'll throw it on there. Maybe you guys can use it. I don't know, we'll have to see, but. Whoa, we might have some miscuts here. So check out the back of this. Way off center. You can tell the left side is way thicker than the uh, the right side there. It might even be a miscut on the front, which is actually pretty cool and collectible. So, I also don't want to mess this up. Look how crazy that is. That is way off. I'm going to do th three. Because see how that's straightened off? So, sometimes it's just the uncommons or like the commons or whatever. So, that's got to be the rare because that one's straight now. So, let's see how the uncommons look on the front. I'm curious. Great ball. So the front is actually not too bad. Top to bottom is off a little bit. Electrode is another uncommon. So that's interesting. And then, so the back though is pretty off. Hmm. That's weird how the front is not, but then the back is. But let's keep going. Okay. Did the pack trick right on this one. Bola B. Dunsparce. Come on. The artworks on these are actually pretty nice. Can we get a big hit out of here? You can potentially get the Celebi EX out of here, which would be pretty cool. So we're going up on the reverse. Not bad. All right. 
Let's see if we can finish it off strong here. Oh, Victini, and it is also a non-house. So we are 0 for 2 so far in this opening. You guys can check it out. The back on that one is actually straightened up. But we're saving the best for last. This has the most potential. I feel like the Charizard in this set as a secret rare could easily go for over $1,000 in a PSA 10. Um, the Blastoise worth a ton as well. We got the Lugia potential in here. All right, I've never opened up one of these before because they're really hard to find. Plasma Storm released in the year 2013. We got another code card too, so these are old school. Let's see what they look like. It unlocks one online booster pack. Um, so yeah, they have cool little themes to them back in the day. There we go. Hopefully somebody can use that. If you did get that code or these codes, let me know if they work. I'm gonna go with three from the back again. Stick to that. Hopefully I don't mess this up. Here we go. Oh, nice. So wait, these, I didn't even realize that the cards even look like, why does it look like that? That's an uncommon. So I don't even know enough about this, but it looks really cool. It's got a blue border. Um, why is it like that? I don't know. It threw me off there, but I thought it was the rare for a second, but that is an uncommon. Whoa. Togetic. I can already see why this set is awesome. I'm going to have to look into that later on. That is wild. I was not expecting that. Togetic. Magneton. So these are uncommons they're throwing in here that could easily be rares in other sets. Clefairy. Is that a common? Wow. Okay. Cherubi. I'm really excited to get to the last one in this. Clink. We got a Zubat. Squirtle. Yo, that is sick. That is a really nice Squirtle. Wow. Alright, we're getting there. I think we're going to come up on the... What do we got? Oh, a dousing machine. Is this the rare? Is it, no, it's not the last card. What is going? I don't know. This is crazy looking though. Guys, I don't even know what kind of hollow foil or reverse pattern this is or if they're all like this. I'm definitely... Is that the rare? No, it is the rare. What do we got? Oh, Torterra. I was... I'm not, okay, I'm not expecting these, but this is the rare. Is this a hollow? Torterra is the... Non hollow uncom that's a rare too. So that was the reverse, I guess, and then this was the rare um coming in as a non hollow number three out of 135. And the reverse dousing machine. Really nice. This is a really cool set. I can see why it's a very valuable set. Uh just even this reverse like has such a cool look to it. And some of these have blue borders. I'm gonna have to look into this after um this opening. But yeah, guys, that is pretty much gonna wrap it up. Let me know if you want to see another one of these um boxes get opened up um that was a ton of fun hopefully you guys enjoyed the black and white era and the video and yeah guys that's gonna be it hope you guys have a great day and i'll see you on the next one